All right, so, I mean, it seemed like you all would ride that wave, that comeback wave in the second half all the way to a victory. I mean, what stopped it, man? Uh, just lack of paying attention. We had a chance to box out a, a great player, which is um, Jackson, and he got a little tip in and gave him a little momentum again because we, we was up by one. And it's just, it's just little mistakes that we got to correct, and they don't always go our way every night. So. Yeah, what, I mean, you know, we had Trez play 39 minutes, Luke played 37, Russ played 32, no field goals in the final five minutes of the game. Was it, was it a fatigue factor? No, I don't think it was fatigue. It was just the way the uh, basketball game went. Just went there. Uh, it is something that everything don't go our way every night, so that's something we're just going to have to uh, build on and get better on the next game. So. What you guys learn from this, obviously? It's oh, yeah, definitely. Game. We shouldn't have put ourselves in a, so much of a deep hole in the beginning. We made a lot of mistakes, and this is easy mistakes that Coach preach all, all we can practice. And, you know, we put ourselves in that position. How difficult is it to play against Cincinnati in the second all the credit goes to the defense. They play a uh, good D. They play real good D. And it's something that we already knew um, how packed in it is, how much they uh, reach at the ball. So it's something that we already knew, but I guess we we didn't prepare enough for it. We weren't ready for it. How frustrating is, you know, you have the big scoring drive at the end of the game, similar to the way it happened in Memphis. How frustrating is to kind of know that you haven't been able to fix that yet, or is it, or is it a different situation here? It is definitely it's different, different situations. Like I said, anything can happen. The ball can bounce their way. A lot of times it's just it's just something that just wasn't our night. From the, from the beginning, we had a horrible first half, and it's something that we can't let happen again because we got to fight the whole fight the whole second half while we down, and that's a, that's, coming, that's a tough position to do. That, that spurt towards the end of the first half, you guys, you know, it was like a 6-2 run or something like that, but you, you seemed really energized there. Was there anything going Going through your head in particular, then uh, we, just, we gotta win this game. We gotta come back. We gotta come back. Uh, it's a tough team we're playing. And we know they wasn't just gonna fold easy. A lot of things was going our way. You know, we was on our run, and we just wanted to keep that going. We got to go up by three, but we just made a little couple of little mistakes, which we didn't make. But, Terry Coach has talked about needing to be positive with this team. What was his message after the game and, and looking forward? He just said. Uh, He's not. He's not going through the little, the little mistakes that we make. He's not going through it no more. Um, and it starts in practice. Everybody has to pay attention because we, we correct them little mistakes and we, we win. I don't, I don't think nobody can beat us in the country. It was a loss, but you know, with the comeback, do you all? Do you all learn from this? I mean, do you feel like there's a valuable lesson here? Definitely. I always learn. Like I said, we can't get down from the beginning. We, we, we built a deep hole for us, and it was tough to get out. We finally got it. We finally came back and went about three. But back to some little mistakes that Coach preached that we got we to gotta, uh, fix. Thanks, Terry.